Well, if there's an echo, I apologize. I wanted to use my good mic, but yeah, that's not happening today. Anyway, I just wanted to say that I got something in the mail today. That rhymed, and I almost hit myself in the face. Let's see what it is. These are so not like the girl in the picture because you are much prettier in person. Oh my goodness, these things are gorgeous. Just for the record, that's the only time I will smell a shoe. It's when it's brand new. If you haven't noticed, these are the Dexter THE 9 HTs. Bowling shoes. Uh, I needed a pair. I haven't owned a pair of bowling shoes since I was in high school. And we'll just say that was uh, about, uh, well, it's over 20 years ago, we'll just say that. These have changeable soles on them. You just pop them right off. They're also swappable. This is the traction one. This is the skid, so you can, they're good for righties and lefties. Um, and these start to wear out. Well, you just uh, order you some new ones. The uh, heels can also come off and you can replace them as well. So yeah, super excited to try these out. They even came with these sexy, sexy shoe covers. Of course they should for as much as I paid for them. And yeah, man, that's, that's them. They are absolutely gorgeous shoes, beautiful. So, let's go to the bowling alley. It is a uh, couple of days later now, and uh, I went bowling again with the shoes today. I wanted to give them another shot because there's a learning curve anytime you get a new piece of equipment. I have zero complaints about the shoes except for one. If you're not careful, 
Uh, they will leave black marks on the lane. Uh, as you see in the video, there's a couple of black jittery marks where I, my toe had scraped. It's only the toe, only the toe of the shoe. But bowling today, not a single mark on the lane. Yeah, um, overall, love the shoes. They're comfortable, uh, they get good grip, they get good slip, and I can already see today, like when I bowled with house balls and house shoes, my score went from I bowl a 250 sometimes, I bowl a 140 another time, and then I stay, that's why I always averaged around 150, 160, um, because I bowl really well and then I bowl really bad. My game was completely inconsistent, and today, it was a little, it went up and down, but it was a little more consistent. And I could see my shots were actually a little more consistent too. Uh, but there's a lot more that plays into that, the lane conditions, the time of the day, um, how tired you are from all the bowling you've been doing. Uh, yeah, the uh, Dexter THE9 HTs, they get a thumbs up for me. I actually get two thumbs up and I have to hold this pole. But yeah, thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed this and uh, see you again real soon.